Cool. Now I've got mud. Here we go! The next exit is approaching. Oops! Don't even think about it! This is my home, not a dump! Well, okay, it is a dump. But don't you dare get it dirty, bonehead! Did you see that too? This looks dangerous. Ah, what the hey? The next exit is approaching. At the same time, not far away. Oh yeah! Lights on, lights off. What the heck? The monitors. They're showing a pattern. It's a message.
The next exit is approaching. Here we go! The next exit is approaching. Useless wears a cape made out of dirt repellent space fabric. In this panel, we see Captain Useless challenging a black hole. Be careful with the needle and thread, handy boy. In this panel, we see Handy Boy stamp envelopes for a press release. In this panel, we see Captain Useless pinning a post-it note to his fridge. We're out of milk. Buy two gallons. This sounds like a new exciting task for Handy Boy. Captain Useless doesn't need any files or other paperwork, except the gas pump bills for his hogmobile. He can deduct those from his income tax. In this panel, we see Captain Useless filing his tax form for the IRS. I think I could make an imprint this way. Wow! That really worked! I'm Sherlock Holmes. You're Watson. I'm Holmes. I'm Holmes. You're Watson. No way! I'm totally Holmes! What's going on out there? I'm Holmes, and you are Inspector Clouseau. Deal! Okay. The boiler is already in use. This should work. This should work. OK. 
Okay. If I could channel it the right way, the pressure from the boiler could be quite useful. If I could channel... Okay. Cool. The water has cooled off the molten gold. Yippee! I've made it! My own master key! Yeah! Yeah! You are free! Ah, that's why the door is open. Don't get your hopes up too high. The biggest obstacle is still waiting for us. What are we going to do next? We need a vehicle. We won't get far otherwise. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. A master key, a vehicle. What next? A perpetual motion machine? Or the missing link between man and ape? I have a candidate for the latter. What are you waiting for? Let's go! We need a vehicle. I'll wait here until you've dug one up. Preferably one that isn't already occupied. Yes, sure. Just pass the hard labor off to the rank and file. You can stay here and keep doing nothing. I'm off now. Yes.
Today is free choice day. Obviously, the chosen meals are arranged according to the seats. The order hasn't been made yet. Today is free choice day. Obviously, the chosen meals are arranged according to the seats. The order hasn't been made yet. Yeah! I'm free at last! Yippee! Let's go to the zoo then! We can't do that, Harv. I have to find some evidence that exonerates my dad. In that case, I hope the information can be found inside those high walls! What? Darn it! Meanwhile... What's going on here? Why aren't the patients having lunch? Doctor, we have a problem. Holger and Babbitt are missing. I've just solved one of the problems. Doctor, it's a catastrophe! Edna's escaped from her cell! Babbitt, how often have patients escaped from their cells? You mean, on a daily basis? Three, on average. And how many of them? have escaped over the wall. Well, none. None. That's right. The only way in or out is the main gate. And even if she finds a way to open the gate, she'll never get half a mile without a vehicle. She must still be somewhere on the premises. Search every floor, one after the other. And would you please escort the patients to lunch? has the incredible ability to sort his trash with only the power of his mind. I don't throw away food. Since when? Let me finish. I don't throw away food without an opportunity to hit someone with it. no use anymore. Hee hee hee! Now Captain Useless has red lips! What was wrong with his lilac lipstick? In principle, the Honkmobile has an auto-locking feature. Handy Boy just needs to change the fuse first. The Honkmobile has six spare tires. Two for every wheel. In this panel, we see Captain Useless jumping on one foot because he kicked the Honkmobile. Who 
was that? You're an odd bird, Edna. Oh yeah, the bird bath has to come with me. I'm looking forward to use bird bath with Dr. Marcel's desk. But what's this? My hands are so badly drawn that I can't lift the bath. Zounds. Hmm, the chirpies will enjoy this. Very good. Now let's hide quickly before the storks come. I'm not doing this to catch storks, Harvey. Hee <laughs> hee, right. It is perfectly safe here, especially for yummy storks! <sighs> In this panel, we see Captain Useless being haunted by the Blue Bird of Disaster. In this panel, we see Captain Useless watching his neighbor parallel park. In this panel, we see Captain Useless fighting radioactive Stone Age leaves. In this panel, we see Captain Useless climbing over the sound barrier. The Derpies will enjoy this. Very good. Now let's hide quickly before the storks come. I'm not doing this to catch storks, Harvey. Hee <laughs> hee! Right. It is perfectly safe here, especially for yummy storks! <sighs> Thank <laughs> you.
If I'm very careful, I might just be able to... without setting off the alarm. Uh-oh, there's Dr. Marcel's driver. Only one time One time Why the one time Uh oh Is anybody there? I better find another way. Laundry lift has been turned off. Darn it. My hands aren't really dirty enough right now. This might work. The chef's not looking right now. <laughs> hey! I've got the master key, and I'm planning to escape. Are you coming too? Mm, okay, but on two conditions. First, we're only coming if you have an escape plan ready. Secondly, you'll have to distract the guards somehow. Work on escape plan, distract guards. Got it. What's for lunch? It's free choice day today. Everyone's having what they want. Or at least, what's been put on the list under their names. The list has been up on the board for a week. I guess I don't have to tell you it's been tampered with. This is an asylum for the mentally unstable, after all. Do you have any idea how I can distract the guards? The surest way would be a food fight. All you have to do is provoke an argument, without getting involved yourself. You'll have to find a weak spot. I'll go hide again. All right. See you later. Before I can start a disturbance, I'll need a plan first. The good old laundry lift. Hmm, locked. It's always the same. How the heck can I get back in again?
These are the sorts of things you learn watching TV or playing adventure games. And now? I don't know how to drive. I should get some help. I'd rather not. There's a watchman sitting at reception. Who's there? You just wait. I'll get you. Gee. Hey, what's going on? Good idea, but just not yet. The gate isn't open yet. Oh no, he's coming. Hey, what have you done? Get out of here or I'm going to be really annoyed. Back with the others, now. And don't ever show your face here again. You hear me? This is the perfect place for my rake! This is the group therapy room. The group is gone. And I thought game developers didn't eat. This might work. The chef's not looking right now. <laughs> hey! Psst! I'll go hide again. Alright, see you later. Uh-oh, there's Dr. Marcel's driver. Uh, oh, is anybody there? I better find another way. He looks busy. You can't know that for sure. Hmm. I'll ask him. Are you busy, Chef? <laughs> See? Better safe than sorry. 
This might work. The chef's not looking right now. <laughs> Before I can start a disturbance, I'll need a plan first. Sounds like someone's eating in there. I'll risk a glance. I'd rather not go in there just like that. It's crawling with guards. This m chef's not looking. <laughs> Hadi, Madi, down here. Can you change a tire by any chance? Mm, sure. There being two of us, that shouldn't be a problem. Why do you ask? Do you have a plan? It's in the making. I'll get back to you. Before I can start a disturbance, I'll need a plan first. Psst! Hadi! Madi! Down here! Do you know anything about motors by any chance? Not the least bit. Why don't you ask Aluman? Aluman, eh? Psst! Hadi! Madi! Down here! Can you change a tire by any chance? Mm, sure. There being two of us, that shouldn't be a problem. Why do you ask? Do you have a plan? It's in the making. I'll get back to you. Psst! Hadi! Madi! Down here! I've got the master key, and I'm planning to escape. Are you coming too? Mm, okay. But on two conditions. First, we're only coming if you have an escape plan ready. Secondly, you'll have to distract the guards somehow. Work on escape plan, distract guards. Got it. Do you have any idea how I can distract the guards? The surest way would be a food fight. All you have to do is provoke an argument without getting involved yourself. You'll have to find a weak spot. I'll go hide again. All right. See you later. Before I can start a disturbance, I'll need a plan first. Hey! Psst! I'll go hide again. All right. See you later.
Looks like the shower scene in Psycho. Wow. Looks like the shower scene in Psycho. Wow. Looks like the shower scene in Psycho. Okay, I have a plan. We'll forge the signature of Ban Ki-moon, then we'll invite the snake to a state dinner. When it finally gets careless from all the wine and listening to the band, we'll jump from behind the buffet and gag it. Then we'll have to act cool until we can politely excuse ourselves, stopping only to tango with the president's daughters first. Oh, Harvey, I can't remember how to tango. There are risky elements to the plan, I know. Just think about it. Okay, I have a plan. We'll pretend that our car has broken down. When the snake comes by, it will stop at the markings clearly laid out to help us. At that moment, we'll pull a rope and a rock will fall on the marked spot. But the rock will be stuck, so we'll have to pull harder. Out of frustration, we'll shove the snake away from the marked spot and stand there ourselves. Only then will the rock give way and bury us instead. All that will be protruding from under the rock will be our hand. The only thing left for us to do will be to hold up a sign that says, Ouch! Have you run out of your own ideas? I don't copy, I'm paying homage. There's a huge difference. Okay, I have a plan. We'll join the government and pass a bill that outlaws all snakes. After the law has been passed, we'll join the snake hunting task force. Then it's just a matter of beating the bushes until our snake shows itself. I don't know. I hate plant cruelty. I'm afraid I'll have to eliminate you now. You're compromising the plan. Okay, I have a plan. We'll attach legs to the sky and lure the snake outside. Then we'll pull away the legs again. And when the sky comes falling down, the snake will be crushed beneath it. Won't the sky block the door to the outside as well? Oh yeah, how do we get around that? Beats me. Don't try to wiggle out of this. This phase of the plan was your responsibility. Some time ago, I was sitting in a cell and talking to the walls. But after painstaking acts of concentration and wit, I have finally reached the men's room and am now talking to the sink. <sighs> you think you have problems? 
Jeez, I am the sink. Wow, looks like the shower scene in Psycho. It's the same on this side. Locked. Looks like the shower scene in Psycho.
I found a van! Have you now? Good. So the hopes I put in you weren't... all for naught. It's in the motor pool garage. You go right ahead. We'll meet there. Don't you want to come along? I already told you. We'll meet in the garage. This might work. The chef's not looking right now. <laughs> Go hide again. All right, see you later. Oh, you're already here. Yes, I am. This is a pretty nice ride you found here, except not only is a rear wheel missing. The motor won't start. I think it's the wiring. But I'm not an expert. So what are we going to do? Good question. I got us a spare tire. Very good. Igor, all we need now is some kind of a car jack. This might work. The chef's not looking right now. <laughs> hey! Psst! I have an escape plan. Our escape car is in the garage behind the house. The only thing we still need is your help changing a tire. Very good. All you have to do now is distract the guards. I'll go hide again. All right. See you later. Food fight! <laughs> I hope Hottie and Marty got out of there in one piece.
Are you ready? Sure. Did you get the spare tire? I'm back again. What are we going to do about the engine trouble? I think it's the ignition. We'll need an expert for that. Somebody who knows his way around electricity. I'll get working on that then. That's what I would have suggested. Hmm, it's not exactly the right make, but it should do as a makeshift solution. Try something else. This isn't destructive enough. Uh oh. Who was that? Champ? Ah. Hello, Edna. Still trying to break out? We have an escape vehicle, but we'll need your help. Yes, yes. Aluman saves the day again. How can I be of help? The motor won't start. It's the ignition. And since you know your way around electricity, I thought... All right, all right. Where did you say the car was? It's in the open garage at the motor pool, next to the back door. Okie dokie. I'll have a look at it then. go in there again. It looks like all hell broke loose in there. Hey, hasn't Aloe Man arrived yet? He popped in briefly. He took a quick peek under the hood, then he cried for a short time, and off he went again. I believe he's sitting in the garden now, meditating. Nice to see you. What's up? Why aren't you with the car? I was already there and took a quick look at the situation. The battery's dead. And there's nothing you can do? That's not what I said. I think I'll be able to recharge the battery. Great! What exactly is your plan? I'll charge it with positive energy. I see. Positive energy, is it? Well, yeah. Um, that... Uh... You have to have faith, Edna. How can I accumulate the necessary positive energy without faith? Isn't there any other way? It's either positive energy or staying here. speed up the process in any way? Align the stones in the right order. They have to vibrate in phase with my aura. Now I definitely know what I have to do. Not. I'll be on my way. 
See you later. Wow, it emanates an incredible calm now. Hey, Alu. Ah, Edna, how nice to see you. What do you think about the pattern that I've raked? What? That is... It's... This is exactly what I needed. It vibrates in unison with my chi. I feel the energy flowing into me. You go ahead to the car. I'll be waiting there. You mean you'll follow? No. I'm already there. You're also able to teleport? Yes. It's either that... Or Pokey was too lazy to draw an animation. Would that be of any help? That is exactly what I need. The motor is running. It really is? What did you think? Of course it's running. Edna, now it's your turn again. You need to find a way to open the main gate. Cigarettes? Chewing gum? Gum would be nice. I'm on it. Who's there? You just wait. I'll get you. Gee. Hey, what's going on? I should do something that prevents the guard from closing the gate again. Hey! What have you done? Get out of here! Why is the gate open? The gate has to be closed at all times! What? The gate is still open? That little brat has tampered with the controls! What's that sound? A running motor. In the garage. Hey, what's going on? There's nobody here. What? Who? So, where are we destined for? Rio de Janeiro! I want to go to my father's house. There must be some clues there about what really happened back then. Something that can exonerate my dad and reveal Dr. Marcel's evil ploy. That's also a good idea. I'd have to know where exactly oh. this house is and how one operates this thing. Where am 
my! What happened? There must have been an accident. Harvey? Harvey? Are you alright? I'm okay. You don't get hurt easily when your spine is made of terry cloth. But we seem to have lost a whole lot of things. Thank you.